Hey everyone. In this video, I wanna share a little trick that I've learned that makes the frequent task of dumping our gray water much faster and easier than it used to be. We tend to dump our black tank every two to three weeks, so it's not something we do a lot. However, our gray tank is something that we have to dump about twice a week. We're pretty opportunistic with it, so whenever we find a dump station, we'll swing in there to dump, even if it's only been a day, because we sometimes don't know when we're gonna find another one. So this little hack that I put together makes it really easy for us to pull up to a dump station and quickly dump our gray water, or dump it into a honey wagon for easy disposal. So let me show you the setup. Under our camper, we have the sewer outlet. And to that, I attached an elbow that swivels. And then onto that, I attached this cover, what I believe is a back flush cap, that you just hook up a standard garden hose to. This was an old drinking water hose that I had kicking around that I decided to repurpose into a gray water dumping hose. So because I have this rear hitch, I usually just let the hose sit. Oh, let's try to get it over there. I just let it sit up there like that, and it doesn't touch the road and it stays out of the way until I need it. So when we pull up to a dump station, which I will demonstrate shortly because that's our next stop, I simply swing this out like this. I pull up to the dump station and I'm able to dump just like that. I don't need to attach my main sewer hose. It does take a little bit longer because the hose is smaller, but you're talking about maybe an extra minute rather than having to get out the gloves and deal with the sewer hose. The other thing that I use this for is for the honey wagon. I just wheel this underneath that hose and I fill it up until it's full and then I go and dump it. And actually this is the same cap that I use down there. I'll leave a link to one of them down in the description. Our next stop is the dump station. So I'll take you there and show you how we use it. Since we travel full time and rarely visit campgrounds, we usually find places to dump with apps like iOverlander and Campendium. So as we're planning out a route, we look for places that we can stop along the way to dump. And being able to simply pull up and dump quickly makes our life so much easier. So we're pulling up to a free municipal dump station. It's, uh, they built it just for RVs and it's at a wastewater treatment facility in, it's either Manchester or? Manchester, yeah. Manchester. We've been using it a lot since we've been here for the last couple of months and uh, we make frequent trips by it and use it pretty much every time we drive by. It's been very, very handy. There's a little hole in the ground and at least for this place, I can just kind of drive over it So I just get rather close and it's very noisy here so I apologize for the noise. So this cover, I usually just lift it off. I swing my hose out and around like this and then I just dump. And you can see it's a little slower of course than a normal sized hose but we probably only have a half a tank of gray water. And this usually just takes a few minutes. I need to clean my elbow, it's getting moldy. So it's much simpler than having to get out the main sewer hose all the time. And since it's just gray water, basically I let it drain and then I put it back away. Simple as that. Now granted, there are some dump stations that we can't do this at because the dump hole is too far away, but that's few and far between. This has worked, I would say, about 90% of the time. You 
that's pretty much it. Uh, it does drip a little bit occasionally, but just spray water, and not really a big deal. So now we can kind of carry on our way. Pretty simple. All right, so it doesn't work in all situations. I did have a slightly longer hose on there, but I ended up having to cut it. I could come up with a better solution. But anyways, this works for us really well. We use it all the time. And it saves us from having to get out our big hose and kind of the mess that that creates. Because we dump our gray water a couple times a week. So the parts to do this are really cheap and I'm gonna leave a link to it down in the description. So I hope you found the video helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. And we have a thunderstorm coming. So I'm gonna hop in the truck and continue on our travels. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.